Everything's good. Ready to go. Do you love me? Yes. True. Do you believe this is your baby? No. It's a lie. The opinions expressed in our content is for entertainment purposes only. We do not assume liability or endorse any of the third party content used in our materials. Okay. What's up? What's up? What's up? And welcome back to <laughs> my two cents. I am Miss O, <laughs> and she is Charisma. <laughs> and today we are discussing Crazy in Love, episode four. <laughs> Some lies have been told, y'all, and we're about to talk about it. Here we go. Okay, so in this episode, we see it's time to take a lie detector test and get the results. Blueface took a lie detector test, and so did Krishan. Is this your first time for a polygraph test? Yeah. yeah. There's some simple rules to get more accuracy. It helps if you answer yes or no with your mouth only, no head or body movements. The more still you are, the better accuracy we'll get. <laughs> Let's do this. It's, the results are questionable <laughs> to me. Do you believe the lie detector test as it pertains to Krishan? Do you believe all that BS? Yeah, you I do? believe I believe some of it, but I believe it's all in a play of words of how a lie detector was. That's why they had to word it in so many ways. Wait, let me let me, let me give you. Let me, it's it's, it's accurate. very accurate. It's very, how? It's very motherfucking accurate. All right, redo the other questions. Talking about twenty twenty three. I ain't. Okay, nobody let me ask you the other question again, since so you want to triple check that question. Yeah, we gotta triple check that. Bitch. Um. Like the baddies say, asking her if she slept with anybody in the baddies, and it came back, that's true. I believe she did. I even said it myself before then. So? Yes. Okay. Did you have a threesome with DJ Scott? No. True. Okay, shit. Did you have a threesome with one of your best friends? I don't have threesomes. But you know, the way he asked, they didn't ask if she slept with anybody. He asked, have you done anything sexual? Kissing is considered sexual and stuff like that. She said, no, I haven't done this, that, or another, da, da. He kind of asked, like you said, each question different ways to try but to. Each time it still came back. back to she lying, so called lying. lying. And when I watched the season myself, I remember telling you, "All right, they done did something on that show." I know, no, no, her and Sky. I no, she trailed the truth on that one. You and Sky did anything? He asked you and DJ Sky, and it came no. So who you think, Scotty? Scotty, yeah, with the body, and Scott, you know. <laughs> Footage has been le leaked of her and Natalie doing stuff together. So, yeah, I ain't see. I ain't see her really. Kashawn kissed Scotty on the show. They were she drunk. She, she kissed Low London on the show. She be grabbing on boobs and all stuff like that. So I'm like, that's all considered. They all do that. That's considered sexual activity, though. But he asked her, "Have you slept with anybody?" Then he asked her, "Have you done anything sexual?" He asked those two questions. And she said no both times. Came, both times, and it came back. She lied both times. But I will say we did. I say with the sexual activity part, she probably didn't think that kissing is considered sexual activity, just due to how some of the stuff we noticed in the house about her when it comes to her intellect. But I yeah. don't know. And then with the other dudes, like her, he asked she even sleep with other dudes and stuff like that. I believe that. You think so? I believe Kashan is spiteful. If she gets upset. Oh, you do what I'll do. It. She tip for tat too. You think she's done it while she's been pregnant? Have you been having sex with anybody else while you're pregnant? No. Off the charts. God damn it! Boys, play with my me, jacket yo. Off. No, because you know that's right, not come true. On, we done. We done. That came back to true. Nah, I don't know. She would move when they asked that question. I even said that. She moved because when she said that, she turned to the side and it said she was lying. I don't think she probably did when she was pregnant, but I definitely believe why they was not, because their relationship is weird. Like women, they say they're not together, the next thing they're together. So, like she said, you do something, I'll go do something. Well, I <clears throat> they asked Tom, they asked in the years. They didn't ask if we were yeah. together or not. I I got a whole nother view on that lie detector. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Number one, 
Mm-hmm. Blueface hired the person. I believe that Blueface. Wait, he hired him or Zeus? Blueface. I believe <laughs> that Blueface hired that man. And it just seems like when he was talking to Blueface, or Blueface and him was having a conversation, it just seems like he's on Blueface's side, period. It just seemed like he was there for Blueface. And he even made little smart or co signed some of the smart comments that Blueface was making. To Krishan. Is there any chance that this could be someone else's baby? No. True. Her opinion. So I fuck with you, John. It's just her opinion. That shit ain't true. You know, he was co-signing some of that BS or whatnot. <laughs> then two, we know about editing. We watched enough reality shows to know that he could say thumbs down, but he could be talking about another whole question. Because mm-hmm. they edit the hell out of these reality TV programs. So I, I believe agree. while I was watching that, to me, I felt like a lot of them questions were just edited by Zeus mm-hmm. or Blueface told him to edit it, you know, in a certain way to paint a certain picture of Krishan. Because I feel like if everything keeps coming back, lie, 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 like 90% of what she was saying was the lie besides her. Her name was the, the truth yeah, of where she, she was from, from yeah. was the only truth that she was telling, or oh, that she loved Blueface, mm-hmm. which we all know that. But I just feel like it was edited for TV. Blueface set it up so that it would make Krishan look bad. And then, too, he's a, he's a terrible actor. I don't agree with that because after the stuff she was lying about, he stated what she was lying about. He's like, who stated it? Blueface, you lying me. You said you ain't do this, that, or no, no, no. But I know that you did that. The I don't way know he like. was saying it, like I said, Blueface to me is not a good actor. Y'all ain't gonna put him on child support. I ain't gonna do that. Maybe I'm gonna put him in. How? Shit. Babe, you wanna sit in the chair and see how it's not accurate? I don't know. Shit. I knew that shit. I'm not putting you on child support. You can tell. He was trying to act like he was upset, trying to act like he was oh, appalled, but it was it was fake. No, I believe, it, like like you said, maybe he he either knew he some of the it questions the that he was him. asking, or he was just trying to, or like I said, it, he knew that it was going to be edited in a certain way to make Krishan look bad. And then too, like I said, like you said too, it seems like Krishan is very naive, and. I feel like he uses that to his advantage. You know what I'm She's not fully naive, like she's trying to make a theme. And I said that's the issue I believe Blueface is having with her. Like you painting this narrative like you're just so cookie cutter or oh, she just you know, she just throw temper tantrums. He's like, No, you do extreme stuff. So what hurt this lie detector, he even said when he walked out, this lie detector is really for you. He said, I already know you be lying. He said, I've been on you been lying. You just won't own it. He said, I own my stuff. I really feel like he wants her to own what she does. I mean, I already knew that. New what? <laughs> like, I, I know how you are. I know, you know. Honestly, the test was more for you than me. It's like he mad. Like I say, he mad that you keep lying. You want a lot of texts. He said, why are you lying to a lot of the texts? Why? Just tell the truth. Like I said, when I say naive, when... I look at Krishan, she's like the baby. Like her family keeps saying she's the baby. And when she talks and when she looks at you, you can see how naive she is in her face and by how she looks at Blueface. Like she's really trying to understand what he's saying, really trying to see if he's trying to get over on me. I feel like Blueface is more um, skilled at the way the world works. I think he's scared in the industry. Like he said, he's right. been a child star since he's been in mm-hmm. Yeah, he's been in entertainment since Right, and she doesn't there. know how things work. So she's dependent on him to teach her. And it's like he is not the one to teach someone. I don't think that. I don't I completely agree with to that. Teach her. I think because she's a lot to deal with. I don't think a lot, even Natalie. Natalie says herself, Krishan is a lot to deal with. She get right. upset. She because ter- of her, her her yeah background. But, like I said, everybody got a reason why they do what they do. But at the same time, her sister was telling they all look at her like a baby. But you're an adult. When you're a baby to your family, but when you deal with other people, 
No, nah, they're going to hold you accountable. Like Blueface said last season, no one holds Krishan accountable. So he's the first one really trying to hold her accountable. But like he said, you've done so much, you can't expect me to still want to do this, do everything, and still be gentle with you. And it's like, dang, you do a lot. She's a rough baby. How about that? <laughs> she's a, nah, she's, that's she's part of that enabling. Yeah. No, nah, she's rough. She's a rough. No, I'm saying she is rough. But the still mentality, like keep to keep using and the stuff she's doing, is like she do, she acts off of emotion, and when her acting off emotion, she does spiteful things. I'm like saying at one this of those point, blue, blue face knows. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying he knows. He's tired he of it. That's why he changed. He even said it in the car. I think it's because blue face is expecting Krishan to be a Jaden, and Krishan is not a Jaden. Krishan is not. As as loyal as Jaden is, yeah, she she's not emotions. loyal to the BS, and I'm quite sure um, Blueface. You can tell by the way he talks to Krishan that he don't hold his tongue for nobody. And I've seen a couple of him him having conversations with Jaden mm -hmm. online as well. He's foul mouth to her as well. Foul mouth, foul mouth. Like he talks, I call her Bees calls out her name, you know, and talks her off. I never the heard. Oh, you know what? He talks to her. He talks her. He's not as crazy as he does with Sean. No, nah, they never fought either. But she, he's still, like I said, it's his personality to talk to his woman or his girl, whatever you want to call it, however he wants, however he sees fit. <laughs> Trifling whore. I'm, I'm not. I'm, but the thing is, mm -hmm. like I said, Krishan is very rough around the edges and she bites back. She matches his BS. She matches his, uh, you know, you want to fight? Let's fight, my nigga. A lie, two a lie detector test. I'm uh, not lying, bro. How, to, <laughs> how stupid could you be to lie to a lie detector? Nobody's lying to a lie detector, babe. Okay. Why you want to play around with the I video? Got... Delete it. Oh. <laughs> Why, you doing Why you always doing weird shit? Why you always doing weird shit? I don't want to be on your page. Delete it. Delete it. It's deleted. Is it really? It's deleted. Can I have my phone? Simple. Take somebody else in there and do it. What do you mean? Man, you trying to be smart. That's that spiteful I mean, shit. You want to delete? You want to win in these fights? <laughs> yeah, but she ain't gonna. But I'm telling. Blueface said, "Lay down." She's not the lay down type of chick. Whereas Jaden would probably lay down. And that's what I'm saying. He's tired of trying to break Krishan to to turn her into a Jaden, and it's not gonna happen. I think it's one of the things he probably told her up front what it is, what it is to deal over here. This is what I do, blah, blah, blah. If you want to sign up, this is how I go. And I believe in the beginning, she probably do to her being naive. Like, okay, I'm cool with it. And just see, like, she really don't like it. Yeah, that's what I really think. Especially after seeing this episode. So, like I said, I don't think that the lie detector test that we saw and how we saw the footage is exactly what went down. Because also, another thing I noticed is that they didn't show the monitor most of the time. I knew that Look shit. at the screen, ma'am. You this lying screen? off the fucking charts in here. All right, here. come on. Let's look at it. You lying off the fucking charts. All right, come on. Let's do it again. He going to ask me again. Uh, all right, calm down. <laughs> Your energy is over here, though. When... I right, just kept showing them lights. And not even all the time. And then it was random. They didn't show the monitor. Where he would just give a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Mostly thumbs down. Not showing the monitor because he if you because he explained to us how the monitor worked as far as the different colors. Oh, so what the red and blue mean? That goes off on the bigger lights. Ooh. The red is her blood pressure. Green is the sweat at the fingers. It goes up big if she lies or if she moves. The fuck? <laughs> Knew it. Ready? You done? Mm mm. I gotta pass that question. You ain't gonna never pass that question. Why? So my thing is. Show me Krishan and show me the monitor while you're asking the question. So and I they should have put the monitor it. above the person's head. Right, should have showed that. But like I can say it was edited on purpose that way. I believe they mixed and matched the questions and what we saw at that time to paint a uh, a bad picture of Krishan. And like I said, we watch so many reality <laughs> TV shows that we know how they play games with editing. So I don't I don't believe the lie detector test. I don't believe it to the full extent of what we saw. I believe, okay, I'm cool with that. I said, I believe it. I do believe they both did some stuff. 
And I believe Blueface didn't want to admit he had so many feelings for Kashan the way he did, yeah, too. Yeah, we saw. He loved her. Right. <laughs> I've been saying it, but nobody want to listen to me. It's the best you ever had. I love you. Everything about you I love, but... That don't mean shit. I love you, too. Said, he got to. That's a lot to put up with. She broke in that man house, stole his car, you and wrote, I love you, boo, and blood on the wall. I think he has love for her mm -hmm. because I think he feels for her. He, like you said, when... How they all, how the whole situation came about by her, you know, missing her tooth and him feeling sorry for her. And I'm going to make you a star. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel that he has developed feelings for her because he is human. Even though he's an asshole, he's mm -hmm. still human. Mm -hmm. I told you. I, I don't know. Me. It ain't what he <laughs> got with Jaden, though. It ain't that. I think she's that. I, I, love, I can love you for a dip from a distance. I have love for you, but I can do without you. It's one of those things like, you think of uh, arranged marriages. Mm -hmm. One of the you put somebody together after a certain amount of time you spend with them, you're going to grow to love them. People like certain people believe you don't have to fall in love. If you're around a person so much, you will grow to love them, whatever. And that's what I believe. Or you I can went. pretend and, and really despise the person. Well, <laughs> that's probably a, they a narcissist or whatever. <laughs> but I've been saying, friends, I believe that he has grown to love her because whenever he used to do his interviews, mm -hmm. he'd be like, the reason what happened with Kashan is he felt sorry for her. He felt sorry for what the situation that happened with her tooth grew up, with her tooth getting knocked, knocked out, out or whatever. When I knocked out, she knocked it out herself. Let's clear that up. But yeah. I do think he got a dream of love. He is happy that baby on the way. He just You think so? Yeah. The lot of texts say, yeah, and I've been thinking that. Cause I don't know if he said he was happy. He just he, he said just didn't. wanna know mm -hmm. if she like the one question I know he wants he already, he believed that was his baby. He knew it was his right. baby. Two months before your pregnancy, was Blue the only man you were sexually active with? Yes. Oh shit. Do it. Do it. Having that intuition, cuz. No. What are you talking about? That's a man thing. Like, you ain't doing that. Da, da, I'm da. telling you, he wants another Jaden. I'm pretty and sure. Kushan is not that. I'm pretty sure he probably got a type. This is type. He's looking for a, a flock of Jadens, and he thought Krishan would be number two, and this ain't that. Crew? You sucking? See, I told sucking. you, I this... just lied on the test. My point was proven. I know what she's trying to do. <laughs> uh, trying what? to play the mind manipulation games. This lie detector test ain't accurate, homeboy. <laughs> hey, y'all. Like, comment, and subscribe if you're messing with the vibe. See ya.